Freeman was pulled from a mangled car after going over a 60 foot cliff in unincorporated El Cajon. That crash was so violent, the muffler from the car was stuck in a tree on top of the cliff. 10 News reporter Emily Valdez is there live now. Emily, how did this happen? I can tell you just looking at this crash scene, it's a miracle that the woman was not more seriously injured. Police suspect she'd been drinking and driving, and I want to show you this. It looks like she came up the hill. She hit the curb here. Her car broke apart. And take a look at that tree. You can see the limb is just smashed. That's what happened before her car tumbled down the cliff. How could her muffler get in the tree? Steve Ross and his wife are friends with the woman who drove over this 60 foot cliff on La Cresta Sunday evening. Oh, yeah, when I walked, when we walked up here and saw the parts in the tree, I'm like, oh my God, what the heck could have gone around here? And, and then saw the car down in the creek and was like, uh oh, this is not good. No, it's not. What is good? The woman driving survived, but you can imagine. In pain. The CHP says she was driving up the hill when she lost control. Investigators think she may have been drinking. Firefighters pulled her from the upside down wreckage. I haven't heard anything about what happened or how it happened. Uh, we just know something happened. The crash happened just feet away from this roadside memorial where this man was killed. Neighbors say he was on a motorcycle. Thank goodness she's okay. You know, it's, it's amazing looking at it that she isn't injured any further. And the woman was taken to a trauma center at a nearby hospital. We are standing on a curve here, and I can tell you cars are whizzing by, and it is quite scary out here. I'm live in Crest, Emily Valdez, 10 News.